Oh my God, Byron, I just had the craziest dream. So we were sucked into this horse's only dimension. At first it was super cool, but then we figured out it was like this false utopia. And there was this lady there named Edwina who was like the boss slash ambassador of the world. She seemed nice, but then we found out she had all these weird rules. It was crazy. Wow, Stanley, that is crazy, but... Are you doing your part? Oh! Oh! Oh, just a dream. Just a dream. <sighs> Wait, I, I don't wear pajamas and I don't sleep in a bed. Are you doing your part? Ah! It's just a dream within a dream. It's just a dream within a dream. But how do I know I'm awake now? Phew. Good morning, Stanley. I heard you screaming. Are you all right? I'm fine. It was just a nightmare. I had a nightmare too. <laughs> In my nightmare, I witnessed my own funeral and you were the only one there. The undertaker asked you, should we wait for more friends before we put them in the ground for all eternity? And you said, nope, he didn't have any friends besides me. And the undertaker was like, really? You mean he didn't have a girlfriend or a boyfriend or both? And you were like, both? That sounds complicated. And he was like, no, 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 not really. It all comes down to communication. If you have that in a solid place, sky's the limit, emotionally and sexually. Cuddling, docking, sucking, fucking, tuning, witching, wean dogging, mork and mindying, the whole nine. It can be quite fun. And then you said, okay, well, uh, we, thanks, man. He never pursued a relationship because he was too afraid. And the undertaker said, sad. And he lowered my coffin into the grave. Bing, bing, boom. He walked away. And just when I thought you were about to start crying, you actually just laid down and took a nap. And I was like, well, he must be tired from all the grief. And then you sprung up and trotted away and said, hey, Anthony, are we still out for backgammon? And then I woke up. Was that your nightmare too? No, mine was different. Uh, I just can't shake the feeling that something really weird is going on in this world. But, but you know what, buddy? I'm tired of worrying about it. I think we both just need to watch TV. Yeah. We now return to The Stud. Becca M. I know we haven't had as much one-on-one -on -one time as I have with Becca L and Ashley G and Ashley D, but this has truly been a perfect day. And I would like to offer you this rose. And this has been such a fun day, but I think I'm going to pass. What? I don't think you can pass on the- Yeah, it's just, you've had sex with so many of the other girls in this stable, and it's really gross. Don't get me wrong, you're super hot. I mean, you're a freaking Zed Derby horse. But I'm really looking for a true companionship. Oh, okay. Uh, do you want me to walk you out? No, I'm good. Maybe I want true companionship, but I am pretty shy when it comes to romance. Do you want companionship, but you're pretty shy when it comes to romance? Then this is the dating app for you. Download Humble now to your smartphone. What have you got to lose, aside from a ton of bodily fluids? Oh, I am so downloading that app. And now, for the exciting conclusion of Koala Lumbo. Koala Lumbo is so cool. Detective Koala Lumbo, <laughs> what a pleasant surprise. I just came by to say you're no longer a suspect in those grisly murders. Well, good. As you know, many witnesses said that they heard me galloping away from the crime scene before the grisly murders took place. So there's no way I could have committed those grisly murders. Right. Well, see you around. Oh, here it comes. Oh, one more thing. I found these in your trash. Coconut shells. How tropical. Yeah, and when you clap them together, they make the sound of a horse galloping. 
Get his ass, Koala Lumbo. All right, all right, it was me. I committed those grisly murders. It's like I always say, if you want the truth, you gotta look for it. That's it. Byron, something weird's going on in this world, and I'm gonna find the truth. Are you with me? Stanley, I am 100% in, and nothing could change my mind. Oh my gosh, I just got chosen by someone on Humble. Uh, it's Crystal from the doll store at the mall, and she wants to meet today. Uh, yeah, Stanley, I've got to go see her. Of, of course, buddy. You know, you go have fun. I'll get started on the mission. Sounds good. Mmm. Oh, these butter roasted shrubs are so good. Mm, I like them too. Um, connection alert. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, how do you like working at the American Horse Store? Oh, I love it. You know, each doll has their own sad story based off real incidences of horse abuse from our old world, and I get to tell their stories so that way those mistakes won't be repeated in our new world. Wow, that's really smart and uh, important, I guess, right? Yeah, well, thanks. I think so. Uh, it's my passion. I have a passion, too. I can't believe how much we have in common. Oh, yeah? What is it? I watch TV. Oh, I didn't know that that was something we could choose as a role. Or you would have chosen it for yourself, right? <laughs> oh, I don't know. Uh, like I said, I kind of love what I do. And I don't really watch TV. <laughs> oh, you're serious? Wait, so you've never seen Doogie Horser? No. Two and a half mares? No. Geld of Thrones? No. I, I don't really have time. Okay. Buckle up and saddle up, because I have a lot to catch you up on. There's got to be a connection, but what is it? Come on, Stanley, think. What would Koala Lumbo do? If you want the truth, you got to look for it. Oh, <gasps> that's it. Time to take this to the streets. Um, a little privacy, please. And then they make Bran Flakes the new king. Wow, that was a lot of names. I know. Is it the best? Mm-hmm. Oh, they always have the cutest hats here. I love hats. Um, oh, yeah? I love hats. You do? I mean, I never even thought about them before, but why not? Sure, that, 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 that could be another thing we have in common. Come on, my tree. Oh, no, you don't have to. Like, oh great, now there's ice cream on my head. <laughs> Classic. Remember that? Yeah, it was a few minutes ago. We both have amazing memories. More stuff in common. Yeah, so listen, Byron, this was really fun. Oh, I thought so too. And I'm glad that we were able to connect, but... Yes, we totally connected. We're a perfect match, just like these hats. Having said that, I'm not... Wait, hold that thought. I want to introduce you to my best friend, Stanley. We live right here. Oh, I didn't realize we were walking to your place. Well, then I guess surprise! Come on in. There's gotta be some sort of connection here. There's too many coincidences, right? Right? Think, Stanley, think. Looked everywhere, just like Koala Lumbo said to, but, but now what do we got? What do we got, Stanley? What do we got? Stanley, I want you to meet someone very special to me. This is Crystal, my girlfriend. Whoa, Byron, hold your humans. I'm not... And I've made a very important decision. I am picking my role in this world. I will be working as a doll ranger and historian at the American Horse Store with you, milady. Byron! 
friend, no! Look, you're nice. You're nice too. We have so much in common. Oh, stop saying we have so much in common. You're trying so hard to make this work, which is as endearing as much as it is annoying. Thank you. But we're just not a match. And to be totally candid, I think before you try to find yourself a companion, you need to find yourself. Once you do that, you're gonna be a great boyfriend because someone will be into you for you. Oh, I'm really sorry, Byron. I I'm sorry this didn't work out, but I'll, I'll see you guys around the mall. That was hard to hear. You okay, buddy? Yeah, I mean, she's totally right. I'm clearly not in the right headspace to find romance. I was just chasing a connection. <laughs> I mean, I hate hats. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Are you okay? Yeah, yeah, I guess I spent my day chasing connections, too. I was so sure all these things were related, but I can't for the life of me figure out how. You know, so maybe instead of being a crazed conspiracy theorist, I just need to pick a role that serves the common good, do my part, and enjoy this world that rescued us. Yeah. God, look how stupid I looked in that hat. <laughs> <laughs> Wait a minute. Look in the background. That's father. I thought he got sent back. So did I. What the hell is going on here? Ah, oh, oops. I got it. I think the E goes there and the D goes there. I, I'm not a good speller, but... Wait! Hold on, Byron. Dwayne is Edwina. Edwina is Dwayne. I was right. There is a connection. Oh, my goodness. What is the connection? It's the same. It's the. It's an anagram. It's it's a set of letters that you. It's you don't see that. What's an anagram? Remember when we watched the movie Sneakers? Oh, too many secrets. Yes. Tech astronomy. Tech astronomy is too oh. many secrets. Yes, you relinquish Scrabble letters, and that's how it works. That's right. 